check this out you guys oh my god I love this area it is so pretty Check this out. So pretty and beautiful. You got a nice little picnic bench here to sit. Ah, I just love it. That's the trail that I tried to hike last time, which is like two miles, which I will do, but I think I'm gonna wait for better weather. It's not that long of a trail, but the fact that you can see moose kind of scares me and if I ever run into or not moose elk I will freak out but yeah here is the water pretty as ever gorgeous it's like a dream we are at one of my favorite places Coffinberry Lake very pretty. Nobody is really here except me and like two other cars. And yeah, it's nice. It's and pretty. This is truly what life is all about. Like, check this out. That right there is what life is all about. You just can't go wrong with the beauty of this. So it doesn't seem real, honestly. It's beautiful out here, nice and quiet. I kind of want to see if I can find a spot that I haven't been to yet because I would really like to go to explore some other areas. You can see how it gets darker over there, which is kind of interesting. Light and then completely dark. It seems as though nobody is at the dock, so we can go ourselves and check it out. You can see the color of the water here as well, which is kind of an interesting color too, as it separates to over here. So here is the map. Um, let's see, this is where we are. I do want to do this trail one one day, but I'm just so afraid to do the trail here, which goes around the lake down there. I'm just afraid to do that because there are freaking elk, and I just saw one, two, two. No, I saw three. Just now driving to here. Every time I drive to this area. I always see elk. They're so pretty and humongous. But they can be very, very, very dangerous. So that's why I'm kind of like sketched out about going to hike it, the place or whatever, the lake. It's only two miles long, which is not really long at all, but you know, I'm just a little spooked. Shelter A. 
reserves today, isn't it? I wonder what these trash can things are. Can you still put things in them? Because they have a weird design. Oh, you can. I guess it's just designed like that for bears, maybe. Okay, it looks like somebody left a whole bunch of weird things. Interesting. Wow. Oh my gosh, guys, look. <gasps> they have a nice place where you could set the fire here. Mmm, they had fire. Oh, it's nice and warm, guys. Ooh, cozy. No wonder I was smelling the smoke. Then I remembered it's a campsite, too, so people probably, you know, are burning a fire. Got a little kitchen over here. Someone forgot to turn this off. This is such a nice area. Lots of picnic vetches and everything. There's more peelings over here real quick. Look. Are these mushrooms? It looks like there was maybe some sort of event here. You can cook here. Wow. This is so amazing. It's nice here. <sighs> Looks kind of cool down there. So this whole state park has like trails that you can walk. There is another trail down that way. Over there. Let me show you. down over there that you can go to if you want but I don't think I'm gonna really be walking the trail today this is nice and warm I'm so cold you see that fire right there piece of log in there going off still dark out here but I just love being out here I don't know what it is I love it it's nice peaceful and quiet in this state park if you guys are wondering it's um Fort Stevens if I'm correct yes it's in Oregon it's really really nice like literally 80% of the time when I come here you I will see a, a freaking elk I'm sorry I can't speak proper English but I will see an elk or some elk or whatever. You just saw three now. Last time I came here, I saw like a whole group of them. It's crazy. That's why it's kind of scary to like walk this um, park or whatever by yourself or just even with people because if you run into elk, again, they're, they can be super dangerous. So it's just always a little scary, but I don't know. We'll have to see. I kind of feel like I should have, um, bought that jacket that I wanted god dang it it's fine I'll get it next time it's probably still gonna be there hmm. I want to get this like Colombian jacket I think if I pronounce it correctly it's really nice but it doesn't have a hoodie and this one doesn't have a hoodie either so I need a jacket with a hoodie but this blue one does so yeah I'm just chilling here for a bit I can hear frogs cricking or croaking coming from the left side. Let's see if we can walk a little a bit of the trail here. And I just ate some food, so this will be some good exercise. You know. You know, you know. Let's see. That's the trail. It goes all around the state park. You can also camp here, which is cool, which is what I want to do. I want to camp here. I just need to um, invest in a tent, and I have a tent in mind that I want to get. It's one of those like foldable tents that you just 
a tent cot. I think that's what it's called. Super easy to put together. And I can do it by myself, and which is just what I need. Perfect. So yeah, you can walk over here. And over there. I do want to try sleeping in a tent by myself. Go camping by myself. It's just I need that tent. And I don't know if it's a good idea to do that while it's super cold. Because right now it's freezing cold. But surprisingly, I'm not as cold right now. Probably because I have the jackets on too. But, but yeah. My phone won't let me record videos really because memory is full. So when I go home, I need to work on deleting some stuff. So nice out here. But yeah, I would love to go camping. The camping spots are like up there in the mountains on that side and to the left, I think. Way far up. So we're going to have to check that out. There's not a lot of people here, thank goodness. I'm thinking of going to a, another spot now. We shall see. But it's so nice out here. So pretty. I think what I need to invest in is some like winter pants or something to because my legs are freezing cold right now but my upper body is fine just my up to my like hips and below it's cold it's some winter shoes i need this is a parking lot here Oop, there's a nice little picnic bench next to my car that's cool Nice. You guys, so last time I came here, they were filming a movie here. I forgot exactly like where, but they were just filming a movie in the middle of the woods. So either some spooky movie or something of the sort, but it was actually quite interesting. Um, really, really interesting. So we're going to Battery Russell. Hopefully I did not take the wrong way. We'll see. Freaking no service in this place. I need to stop saying freaking. I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, so they were filming me a movie. I'll show you kind of where. It was more like in a. It's more downward from here, I guess I should say. Let me show you when it comes up. But it's just so nice here. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. If I remember, I'll include the clips of where they were filming a movie which you'll see hopefully i remember to put that in this video but it's so cool so pretty it was like in this area right here because you see how the super tall trees and in the woods like on the side but it wasn't on this side it was on the left side like over here they were filming a movie down there in the woods which is like the perfect place to film a spooky movie or something like that you know it really is I like this area. Kind of should pull over over here and just chill. Because the woods are just breathtaking here. I don't know what it is. It's just so beautiful. My goodness. Every time I drive by here, I'm just taken away by the beauty. It's gorgeous. I would love to walk in the woods over here, but definitely not by myself. I wouldn't be too scared, but like maybe with a group of people or something. I think that would be kind of cool. Or like the park rangers or something. I don't know if they do that though. So we're going to the battery Russell. Sorry, my shoes are kind of squeaky right now. When I was walking in the store earlier, my gosh, they were so damn freaking squeaky. That was nuts. You hear that? Squeaky on my because I have rubber mats. Yeah, they're very squeaky. What's on the left here? Oh, another trail or something? Or Oh yeah, it is. It's a trail at least, so like a road. Okay, we're almost at the bat battery wrestle. We've been here before, and I've recorded this area, but yeah, it's just, I kind of like this area. I'm going to chill in a parking lot here for a bit, and decompress, and just, oh, oh, elk, 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 look, 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 look. Do you guys see that? Second sighting of elk. Oh my god, there's a whole group of them. Wow. This place, man. This place does not disappoint. 
Look. There was elk over there, but I can't stop and see them because there's cars behind me and it's hard to know if they want to watch too or what's going on. Wow. Yeah, this is amazing. This I love this place. The fact that you can literally see elk is the best. It's the best. I can't I can't even tell you guys how amazing it is that you can see elk. So, as I said earlier, the elk are over there. I am debating if I should go a little bit closer to them and watch them. But I don't know if I should. I don't see them from here, but they're in that area somewhere over there. I don't know. But then this area here is nice because there's like nobody here and it's just, oops, sorry. It's just me and the other cars are like more further away. I can't speak at all proper English today, guys. I'm so sorry. It's been a while since I actually vlogged, which I know it doesn't seem like it because I've been trying to do a lot of pre-recorded videos and I'll take like breaks in between the videos that I make. So, I don't know. Sometimes I think I speak before I think, if that makes any sense. I don't know, sometimes I feel like words just come out before I can function a normal sentence. But yeah, this, just, I just love this state park. It is amazing. Freaking, the fact that you can just see elk, like literally almost every single time and everywhere is amazing. I haven't seen them in this area before, so that's a new one right there. I'm trying to see, hopefully they'll come closer. If they do, we can go and look at them. But that's what's kind of scary about this area because of the fact that if you were to like walk around here and you saw an elk again, you know, they're dangerous animals. And it's just kind of scary to think about like what if they attack you or something i don't know but i love this place nonetheless oh this camera is like a following camera Ooh, that's cool i forgot i can do that but yeah i'm filming with the dji is that what it's called i always pronounce the name wrong yeah dji usually i say dgi for some weird reason but yeah so it's just like amazing. I love this park. I'm in love. I love you park. Who would have thought? I don't know what I'm trying to say. I forgot to take off my Google Maps before I freaking... Oh, that was nuts. Turn that off. But yeah, it's just... It's beautiful here, guys. I'm sorry. Like, I'm filming completely on my DJI today, so my video is completely here so if it doesn't look good i'm sorry i need to i mean i don't know if it doesn't look good but like i don't know what i'm trying to say i'm sorry i'm so out of it this area though let me get out and show you what it looks like. so here is this parking lot we just came from that entrance over there where we saw the elk and then over there you can go to the battery russell there's only one other car here the other ones left um yeah i love this spot it's nice and quiet and peaceful there's a nice little picnic benches here it isn't busy today which i'm so thankful for this is a perfect spot i need to come here again one day with my dogs because that would be super nice oh i think i see the elk from here, I can't tell if that's an elk or if it's something else. This is one of my favorite bridges here. I haven't been on it. Next time I will figure it out and probably go on it. Again, ooh, that looks like it went deep into the forest. That would be fun. I need to get a bike. That's what I need to do. I need to get like a bike and invest in one and then be able to take it here. Oh my gosh, that would be so much fun. So much fun. Yes, definitely would be. So I'm going to end this video here because I'm going to start heading home soon. First I have to make two stops somewhere. I need to get a new charger because I think mine's like on the verge of breaking and not working anymore. So I need to get a new phone charger and I'm going to see if they have any um, day backpacks at Big Five. I don't know. I bought one there for like 40 50 bucks, but I don't know if I like it. I mean, it's not bad, but it's just like very manly, if you know what I mean. And it has so many zippers. I don't know. Maybe I could just sell that one. I could buy another type if I see a nice one at, you know, Big Five. And then, because I want like a smaller one. 
that doesn't have too much pockets, but like maybe three. The one that I have has like, ugh, maybe more than five, I think. I don't even know. It has a lot. So we're gonna be going left to Warrington. Mm -hmm. Anyways, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know it was a little bit random, but I just wanted to kind of get a video off for you guys. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.